Here is your Wednesday preview for November 11th. Your kettlebell exercises all the way through down to your push-ups and then one time each side your mobility complex. Pretty straightforward. Then you work out. Uh, that's it. Uh, AMRAP, as many rounds as possible. That's all we're doing, one through 12. Get in as many rounds as you can and uh, you'll see uh, in color the highlighted uh, kind of modified numbers, modified exercises as needed. And I'm guessing probably three rounds, maybe four, depending how fast or heavy you go. And I want to appreciate everyone coming in with their masks on and doing their best. Again, we're really encouraging our mask breaks um, and breathing properly as much as you can. Obviously, come on in and we'll explain everything as you need to know. Um, but thanks again for um, everyone really complying with the masks. Appreciate it. Doing our best to flatten the curve and please keep coming in. All right? and it doesn't do anybody any good if you want to say, oh, I'll wait till this passes and I'll stay home. You've got to stay healthy, which means you've got to keep working out. And we modify in here to make working out um, doable as we possibly can. All right, so Wednesday workout. So our warm up, uh, swings, clean and squats, slashers, lunge and press, curl, extend, standing twist, push ups, and then your mobility complex, one on each side, pretty straightforward. Your workout, your broad jumps, again, uh, depending on the humidity tomorrow, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, just be careful of the floor. If it's kind of slippery, be careful, but your broad jump is just nice big. Go, land, nice and easy turn, and go. Then we're gonna do our deadlifts, all right? So if anyone wants to get here early and uh, push themselves on the deadlifts and they wanna get a barbell, go on, go on over, get it, bring it to your spot, it'll be yours. Otherwise, the deadlifts with a kettlebell, two kettlebells, big, heavy ones if you want. We're a little wide with our stand. Get as low as we can, keep that back nice and straight. All right, watch, as you can see, a little arch in that lower back, push the hips back, down, Squeeze those glutes as you stand up. Ten of those. All right, we haven't done this one in a while, but it's a fun one. So we're going to be bent over, chest slam. So again, kind of like that deadlift position at the very bottom, and then we're going to pick up that ball and slam it down. Get it. Those are fun. Ten of those. All right, we've got our ab wheels. So one for every spot. If you don't like the ab wheels, if it doesn't feel good, get a Swiss ball out, and you can do some plank circles instead. Then number five, simple push-up, four mountain climbers. All right, so it's push-up, one, two, three, four, push-up, and one, two, so just five of those. Your hand-to-hand -hand sumo. Okay, so sumo squat, think. And get nice and low with that butt. As you come up, pull that weight up, and switch up top. So use a lot of your legs to kind of pull that weight up, and then switch hands up top. 10 of those. Plank, fly, this is with a light dumbbell comes in. So, just one dumbbell, one hand's gonna be on the ground, good solid plank, the wider your feet will give you a little more foundation, might be a little easier for you. Find a spot that works for you, and then control that. Okay, nice and easy, bring it up, and control. So we're gonna do five of those on each side. Again, light weight for that one. Your windmill, quick reminder, toes, find a line, you're gonna rotate a little bit to the uh, opposite side, but whatever has that weight, push the hips out to that same side, and let's pick up that opposite leg, so you know most of that weight is on that kettlebell side. And bend at the waist, use your hand to guide yourself down, and back up. Five of those on each side. And we go to a kneeling, one arm high pull, one foot, one knee, the knee side has the kettlebell, and you're nice and tall. One arm high pull. If you can, don't let it hit the ground. Stay up the whole time. Five on each side. Then we go to our figure eights and lunge. Just 10 of those. Back to a light dumbbell, supine glide. So we're on the ground, lying down, and then we're going all right on the side. The elbows should touch first. The, the dumbbell probably won't touch, so keep a slight bend in that elbow. Squeeze the chest as you bring it up. You get five on each side of those. And we'll finish with kettlebell. Long press, and then you got it. Bottom half of your Turkish get up at this point. And then slowly come back down. Elbow, control it. Elbow back down, and repeat. Five and five on that one. 
and we'll get through as many rounds as we can. All right, guys, keep up the good work. Let me know if you have questions. But please keep on coming in, and we'll work around this pandemic as best we can because we're going to keep you healthy. That's the important thing. See you Wednesday.